That run was just bad, I wanted to reset, it's okay. You're supposed to leave this fight with 50 gems or grind. I've never left this fight with 50 gems, by the way. That's why I'm always going to that one field to farm for Nagas. Uh, we have 42, so that's even less than last time. Good. Everything's great. So unfortunately last run wasn't having very good luck on the gem farming and now we have to farm more gems because I'm too dumb to listen to the recommendations to reset the uh, beginning of runs until you have 50 gems, so my runs feature farming. Another thing in my runs feature that others don't is hauling in holes. And dying and taking damage. I chill out. Whatever, we're just gonna farm here. Fine. We're not gonna farm here. <laughs> I'm not slowly cheering to die. So I can reset. Try for 50 gems again. How would I be doing that? 
torches, back dashing. Pirates. This game you just start with it. First thing I did in the game was look at the controls and be like, oh good. I know what I'm gonna be doing for the rest of my life. do it a lot faster than I do it half the time. I'm just trying to, like, not miss inputs more than... Uh, doing it perfectly optimal. Like, right there. I'm trying to have less of just stopping dead in my tracks than anything. This one, it's free. The very first thing I did in this game was open up the controls and say, oh, wave dashing button. Future has it. No, nope, jump on that. Back, back, back. Jump this way. I'm not entirely sure this runs very good. You looked at which one? If you looked at pirates, you might have to look deeper, because I know I saw it in the shop for a hundred. So, I don't know, maybe they skip it? Oh, I want that. I have not watched a speedrun of uh, Pirates because, uh, obviously, I haven't played the game. I'm trying to, like... Avoid any information. Although I think I saw somebody on the Risky's Revenge later board that had like a 140 something and 100 percent so I'm assuming it's at least not that much longer to speed run. This one's an hour 19. That one might be like an hour 40 or something. Well, it is 100 gems, so maybe they don't grind it very early. So if we ever get around to being able to play uh, Risky Revenge, we probably won't get a sub-1 or sub-2 in that game. <laughs> Sounds like it'll actually take work. Being good at the video game. This one is more free, except for I threw away like seven minutes yesterday in the last split. Also, dolls, if you do exclamation part Discord, if you check the Speedy Nonsense channel, I posted my splits from yesterday's run there. Went from like six minutes ahead to a minute behind <laughs> trying to hit the frame. Was a bit sad. Uh, everybody post sad blue bunnies in chat for Maggie's. So yesterday's uh, arc of learning on the stream, 
was first I realized, oh, so this is how people farm money if they're incredibly short, like I apparently am. And then later in the stream, I learned, I think, why I was incredibly short. I realized what the pike ball gem duping was talking about. I could talk about it more, but I don't know. I think I'm going to be doing that anytime soon, so maybe I should just wait. It's also still thundering outside, and the lights are occasionally flashing a tiny bit, so if at any point the stream goes down, it's either that or the usual, just the computer sucking. I'm not trying to make this stream about, like, hey, join the Discord, but I'll probably mention that if it, like, actually goes out and I just give up on coming back to stream. I promise I'm not, like, that desperate. <laughs> I'm just saying, well, you know, I could also just open my chat. I could probably just open my chat if I do and be like, uh, yeah, sorry. You know, forget it. I'll join my Discord. I'll just come back to chat and say, uh, sorry, uh, internet. Gone. Thanks for watching. series to go all the way back for? I don't remember if there's something else that's like, yeah, we really need this in the beginning. It definitely saves time, but I don't know if it saves enough time that it's worth it to run over there and grind gems. Should probably just not be a baby and do a reset stream. Yeah, besides for the fact that I have to meme and use the ball and ball weapon, because yes, uh, just is effective, I guess. Especially now that I've realized that it just dupes everything, I think. You know, I'll take that. I will absolutely take that. I wasn't even thinking about, like, collecting what was in there. I just hit it because I always hit it, and then I was like, wait... yesterday is that the gem duping I was hearing about, you can 
if you walk to where a pod is, like right in the center of it or inside of it, if you walk into it and spawn your pike ball while you're standing on top of it, it counts as like you hitting three separate pots on the same frame. So it just, just triples whatever's inside of the pipes. I think is what I finally figured out yesterday. And I was assuming that was why I was very short on my PB. So like, money, I think you can just triple. You can triple heart pickups and magic drops. And I was like, dude, that's why I'm just like kind of playing the game right now. And I'm like a little bit excited to get later in the run where you start having pike balls so I can like show it and utilize it because I didn't utilize it until like the third quarter of yesterday's run. It's still thundering outside, so we may never make it there, but... Also, here's the hoping I don't die, because I have a quarter on my neck. I miss you guys. Uh, tips. I would set the headset, like, on the desk, but really have anywhere I can set it that it'll stay. Or that'll still be audible. So... Uh, ouch. Ouch. cheering or just general cheer. I want I want to make an emote on the one sprite. When she does the successful dance and strikes the pose, that's what I want. She raises her hand up in the air. Oops, I think that's my favorite sprite. down here, switch back, fall down. Yeah. I probably also did it. I did it yesterday. <laughs> I don't know why being a monkey is like, girl, no, it's Chante, idiot. save time, but I don't know if I use it well enough that it warrants me running back to. Alright, uh, monkey moves faster, so you want to transform before going back in this tunnel, and then you won't fall down after as a bonus. recent you've been here for run dolls, but we now have stopped being a baby and we learned how to do boss skips. So you also will get to see one of those if I can open this door. Wow. So you really haven't been here at all, have you? I made a comment in one of my runs. I was like, hi YouTube, and then I didn't bother uploading it. I might upload one if we get like a 155 or something. That might have been too late. That might 
might have been good. That was not good. We'll heal a little bit and then we might have to go back and try again. Well. say GG yet. I still have to grab the thing without dying. Which I'm terrified, so I'm just gonna sit here. Okay, we're losing time, but eh, not that much. Definitely wasn't great. Did you play enough Spyro games? I only say that because I want to know if you agree with me that these orcs look like they belong in a Spyro game or something. If I wasn't dumb and hadn't just started a run, I'd probably just like bend stream and go hide in the corner instead of using my computer. But now 
Now I feel like I'm being about the maximum uh, amount of dumb with a headset around my neck. <laughs> I'm like tempted to just set it off to the side. Oh, I was like, what the heck achievement? have all the achievements in this game, that was Uni's library being available. Oops. Uh, Honey Pop. So yes, uh, the, the this, this game's main character is very pretty. That is, uh, at least half, probably closer to three quarters of the reason that I'm actually fighting it. <laughs> is it like super fun? It's alright. But cute game. I don't even know how honest I can be about the... So let's see if I can... I don't know if that showed anything on Yeah, the game... Okay, the game's fun. I'm definitely having more fun with it lately than when, like, I started. It's a short, fun speedrun, uh, except for a couple minutes, probably. Which I guess is my own fault for trying to do them in the run. Thanks for stopping by, y'all. Have a good night for me. What not? Sorry if that didn't sound hurtful enough. Dolls definitely is based. Can confirm. Can confirm. It's the second time. Second time dolls have been based. I mean, I'm assuming the second game is more of a Metroidvania, or, like, longer, more of an actual game, I don't know. Uh, this is the fourth game, third, third game, third game, Dolls? Listen, this is the third game. Should you play the first one? Uh, what are you trying it on? I would try it, but... I don't know if you can see there, but I think I got, like, double rewards for those. I don't know. Maybe I haven't. Send it to me, I'll try it.
Actually, wait, that's just a Game Boy game. You can play that on the greatest Nintendo platform. Oops. <laughs> Dolls is on board. He already made the joke once today. So, so I don't know if you can tell. I think I'm getting like double the amount of those. You saw that spit out two gems. Which is maybe just normal, but maybe not. Monkey. So I'm gonna start doing that on a bunch of the pots. So I do less pointless farming. If I just get double money for everything. So there's a pot right here. Uh, sorry, it only works on things that are inside of pots. It does not work in chests. Wait, sorry. I'm forgetting to play the video game. Too busy talking. Uh, so I think we'll get to use Pike Ball. Uh, one of the reasons I was mildly excited to have this realization is that I think... I'm assuming it'll work in the Battle Tower. And I can do less bargaining every time we finish a round to say, hey, can I have a good drop? Every time I finish, I'm like, can I have some magic? Or it's like, I'm full on magic. Can I have some hearts? And the game's like, nah, I don't think so. But maybe, if whenever I'm like, I really need a lot of stuff, I can just quickly slap it with a pike ball. Also still thundering outside. Extra encouragement to go faster. So if I just pop this right here. Yeah, everything's full. Wait. Oh my god. <laughs> wait. Wait, can I just get like an insane time in this tower too? By duping the clocks? So, like, pay attention. I am a heart and a half short. Got a little bit of magic missing. I'm gonna go over here, stand in the middle, and try to... Well, I didn't get any magic. So I didn't prove anything. Alright, let's see the timer here. <laughs> yeah, see, it went up by 40. It said 20, but it went up by 40, because I think I just duped it by having the pike ball. So there's, like, the best proof I can give. Ugh! Also, like, pike balls faster to kill enemies here, but I was always worried about running magic, so I want to know if I can just... just fudge the rules a little bit. <laughs> Timers are gonna be so high! This is so funny. I'm already full on everything, so I'll just slap it. <laughs> 440! Love this. Stop. All right, you're dead. How many more? I'm already full. I really so I'll just slap it. True. Five minutes. Bold record pace. I was like, maybe I should go collect more. No. I only need a tiny bit of magic, so I'll just slap it. I don't need any time, but it's funny. Probably 
probably should have read the news. Somebody was nice enough to like have the whole route written out and I was like, what if I watch the record and just try to copy that? So like, if you see, obviously both of the pike balls have to spawn out from like the center of you. So I think if you're just standing inside of it, both of them hit the pot on the same frame and it's like, uh, okay. You can, if you, I mean, I don't know if my res is not good enough to see, but like I could see two magic decanters came out. Wait, why, so why can't you just like stand inside of an enemy and damage them twice in the same frame and break the game? trying to get rid of the pike ball, but it's still there. This makes a lot more sense. Now I know how they can just... Are they jars? My bad. idiot. It's clearly a bank vault. What else could hold that much money? They're hoagies. Heroes. saved a bunch of time for like having free pike ball all the time. Which means I'll probably save a little bit more time by repeating the exact same thing. Free pike ball. This is great. I love this. You already thought pike balls were based and broken, and they're also balls, so like, bias and everything, but damn, did you think they could get better? You just get to double or triple everything. For absolutely nothing. That is absolutely insane. <laughs> did you abuse the heck out of them like this? I abuse the heck out of them. I, I, ab I love abusing the heck out of my balls. Look at all those abuse. Inventory pirates? What does that mean? Oh, 
you guys. Can I just wait for you over here? There we go. Find some food and junk. What kind of junk? I don't remember how they get up there. I feel like they don't switch to monkey every time. Do they just jump up here? I feel like I didn't remember watching them jump up here, but I don't think they want me to remember. Okay. Oh, more magic. So the only thing I need is one heart. Let me just slap this. Yes, this isn't Rabbi Ruby, so she has drums. laughing, but I am. That was a bad, bad idea. <laughs> Yo? Saved? Especially if any one of these enemies drops a heart. by just being able to run double pike ball all the time and not care about anything. Tower! God, last time I almost threw by talking to him a third time and being like, yes, I want to go back into the tower. Um, yeah, because you have to do tower twice because the second run gives you magic jam. I am now going to uh, save my game because I've realized that I don't have much health. Um, I would rather not die. If I touch any of these, I'm just going to die like instantly. Uh, now I probably will. Prefer 
probably not die. Mm. Ah, just some health. I want... Wait, okay, we're gonna abuse our powers a little bit more. Because I know there's a heart in here, but... Okay, it didn't work. I was gonna say, now there's two hearts. And never mind, didn't work. Okay, this is the monkey room. Might have to take a quick uh, drink break. But if we don't, then I think we get a health up soon. And we'll be fine. yet. This is for elephant, and then we come back to the desert. No. Okay, we're going for elephant. Go left and go up until... Okay, I don't know why this is up. It's kind of weird. Here. Dash like once to the right. Jump on here. Um, don't die. Uh, well, I know pretty quick in here. Yeah, that just refills her health. Like, I don't know. Is it, uh, at all actually... Uh, can you, like, see on stream that I'm getting double the profit from jars, or... Does it just sound like I'm still making things up? I know more so in some cases, like, in the battle tower when I picked up the time, it was like, okay, you see it says plus 20, but my clock went up 40, so... I think then you can tell. split is. Apparently we're losing some time, but whatever. It's not that important. Elephant dance. Also, maybe I should split during the white flashes to make more sense and not take my finger off the keyboard. Dance. Now we're going to attempt to not miss this. record run they were like I'm gonna try this once but no 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 I'm just gonna get it uh, I probably shouldn't have done that uh, okay that one's definitely like not worth it like get some more money but then I have to elephant dance twice don't need double money everywhere here you elephant dash 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 up Elephant dance, dash, drop. I don't have dash. I don't have stop dancing. Uh, talk to these fools. So I think here we need to go this way, go back a layer. Go straight this way. Uh, monkey, jump to the top of this room as quick as you can. Uh, elephant. I probably didn't need to do it that quick, but I did do it that early. Uh, no, I don't need to monkey dance. Back dash, drop down here, because then it just respawns you at the beginning of the room. Uh, ignore everything in this room, because I don't care. Ouch. Uh, elephant, you will see why in a moment. Elephant, 
my guess is faster traversal than uh, backdashing, but the transformation takes time, but at the end of this dashing, there is just a rock that you have to break, so it's worth it. Also, if you have to go across like three rooms, I think it's faster. Two or three rooms, I think at that point, like it'll be faster or something. Hello? Thank you. This is a heart holder, so if we didn't have full health, we do now. Uh, I'm not done yet. Good times. What's what happened? Uh, we're back to the desert. Uh, elephant dance, not because this is a long... Well, of course, the good times are because you get double chanting. This is not because it's a long distance, but because it ends with a smashable rock. Uh, sad. No more pike ball. power. Not to be confused with rocket power. And now you might be saying, oh, no more monkey. Okay, no, now we turn back into monkey. Because now we're going to start uh, doing the abuse of the monkey dash. Sometimes you just want to use it to do something like that. Dash the wrong direction. I no longer have Pike Ball. Okay, so this is another case. I think I saw them do it here. Take some damage, or whatever. I, it's also just nice to use Monkey on screens like this, because you have a smaller hitbox, and if you fall on the holes, you can at least bail yourself out. It's easier to jump over the giant enemies like this. Back dashing. Uh, I mean, monkey's cute and all, but also I'm Shantae, so what's your point? Nobody ever calls the elephant cute, they only call the monkey cute. I'm hopefully gonna do this room faster than I did in yesterday's run. My sister likes elephants, she'd probably call the elephant cute. My Twitch chat's just a bunch of haters, though. Slap that for no reason, especially double no reason. I think that's the... I got dash and stomp, so I split there. That split I never hit, that's the hardest part of the run. Okay, that was interesting. Glad that didn't blow my game up or anything. Uh, there's a bunch of hearts in there, but I don't know it. Okay, he's hoping there'd be magic in there. Um, I do want to make sure I'm full on magic because I don't like this next room. Not that I need it, but just because I don't like it. Uh, go to the right door. Transform into Monkey, we're going to use Monkey Dashing again. Instead of going left through that room, we're taking the quicker route of dashing that way. We'll get to this wall, we'll Monkey Dash again. Hopefully not fall into a hole. Get shot, fall in a hole. Okay. Uh, not fall into this hole. Okay. Just 
chilling for a second so I don't own myself again. Backdash off this cliff to respawn. Um, um, you know what? Elephant. Still take damage. Oh, I needed the elephant at the end of this anyway. Alright, this is the room we don't like. This is why we don't like this room. Uh, fall off. Respawn. All the way right. Up. Oh, save our game. Just because I'm scaring myself again. Uh, I don't like you. done with this yet? I'm gonna switch over to double pike ball just to try to pick up a little bit more health instead of re-entering this room like 20 times like I have in the past. Start using the double pike ball for less trips. Uh, just gonna jump over this guy and then dash into him. Smart. Uh, uh, no. Forest. Uh, I mean, I guess I can't really say we're I'm just gonna make it sound like we're losing time, but no, we're not. Uh, I'm gonna need the fireball again in this split, but it's fine. Okay, let me just miss. Here we're turning into elephant because we're gonna dash into the sky and we're gonna leave. Thanks for the heart. Shoot it. He said, why did you break the guy? We're not gonna go. Well, we're gonna go back. I don't know why they like specifically hit it before, but that's what they did. Oh, this is the stinky room. <coughs> I don't like this room. It's just platforming, but. I do a lot of waiting in it because I know. They do a lot of monkey dashing in this room too, just climbing out of the side of the blocks, but I don't like trying to do any funny business on one tile block, so. We are baby. Hit that. Don't do anything stupid. Grab the beans. Backdash off. Enter again. Now we go back this way. Smash more rock with broke. Uh, I feel kind of dumb to do it, but I want to make sure that I have more than two and a half hearts, so I'm going to enter the beginning of this dungeon. Because I know there's a full heal here. The room at the end of this hallway is a little bit dumb, so I want to just be safe. Rather than sorry in this moment. Uh, okay. It is a 100% guarantee that I will fall in the hole. Whenever we get a full run without falling in the hole, same time, it'll just be the greatest run of all time. I'm going to just start bike balling all of these enemies because I hate them all. This really doesn't matter. Because this is the first time that I remember what the instructions say. Hit this. Cool. Got the broken coffee machine. You're not going to kill me today. I'm going to kill myself. Okay, that doesn't look that fast. It's better than doing the other room, but anyway. So, jumping down here. Fireball. I don't have to go back into the menu. Here. This is where you get the magic. I just hit the first one because I found out that I can just not care. 
slap this. But that's gonna just change me back anyway. I'm done. Uh, jump up here, transform, whip dash. you today. Lilac Fields. We have Elephant Stomp. Elephant Stomp? Elephant Stomp. Run back dash once, walk to the right because it's a faster way to transition through rooms, enter this tunnel. here though is the fact that they made the whole funny sprite for her using the bird like a wrench and then you also like walk directly in front of it so like what's the point now we go shopping triple fire instead of uh, cream now, so we're going to be losing a little bit of time, probably. Like, not really, but... I mean, we just attack faster, attack less fast now. In exchange for having an open we're going to use. So, that's unfortunate. Not really a big deal, though, probably. Did by a storm cloud. It would have been a lot more trouble if we didn't have to fight a storm cloud, honestly. Because it's literally required in the next dungeon. I don't think cream is required for anything. So this is another one of the cases where you're gonna see me using monkey on this screen because it's just easier to try to platform quick and squeeze through some gaps. Or if you fall down, you have less of a chance of immediately dying. You can clear the blood kisses sometimes. Dodge tridents, or run into all of them like I'm doing. Land on top of them like I'm doing. Worry less about buff squirtles. Uh, jump into the enemies. I don't need that, but whatever. We'll take it, I guess. Huh, was that? Is it morning already? Yes. Is there enemies on this screen? They're not going to land in the water. You want to give me a heart? No. So I'll probably leave here and just eat a potion. No point in risking my life. You know what? I was gonna hit you and then I was like, why am I gonna hit you? I don't need the hearts anymore. You lost your chance. Uh, 
Once again, this is the longest split of the game. Probably. Which doesn't mean anything, besides for... I don't have 100 splits in this segment, I guess. Because this is all the way up until the mermaid power, after doing the whole... key collecting eye puzzle in the next dungeon. Hopefully I will not forget to collect the item after I get the mermaid power like I did yesterday. Which was followed by me failing the boss skip. Losing multiple minutes. This room used to be terrifying, but like honestly, now that I just eat a potion and it's not that bad. So this is why I was just saying that I would have been absolutely screwed if I didn't buy the electricity power. It would have been a lot worse if I didn't have any electricity, or if I missed the triple pike ball. But I guess since it's the cream, I'm just gonna pretend like that's fine, I think. Uh, this one you want to hit down. Instead of playing the game correctly, we're going to do this. Okay, so these are all hidden, but we'll start doing funniest. So we have 46 gems. I got 40 gems out of that. I think they're supposed to give you like 13 or something. But tripling it. Because it spawns and damages the pots to open them, but it spawns and like hits three at a time, so it's like, uh, more? This needs to go up now? Sure. Probably. Sometimes I look at these pillars in the background and think that they look like weird instruments. Uh, boners. I just don't want to deal with them. And now that I know that Pike Ball is just cheating. Uh, don't hit that guy. There's an achievement for killing one of these guys at midnight. I would have, like, not ever understood that one, but I got it because I stream at midnight. Monkey. Just monkey and don't care about it. Hit that. Can I... This is another case where I have so many notes that it's hard for me to figure out where I am at points of time. Even though I think I know, like, where I'm going, I want to try to leave it open to... Be less sure about it. Nice. I never posted. I got a shiny pee bass the other day. Just some random night. Yeah, it was a female too. I know that like technically probably doesn't mean anything, but. Maybe they're all female. No, never mind, my other one was male. Do not hit that eye yet. Jump up here, dash, dash again, dash away all. Monkey, monkey. Uh. I love having a triple pike ball and just not caring about anything. Absolutely cheating. Um, monkey, 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 monkey. Uh, a little bit less high. Right there we go. Go in the right, right door first. Scroll down a little bit more of my notes. 
Uh, this room I somewhat know how to play it less, I think. Not like the actual fastest way to not play it, but... Uh, drop down here. Slap B, slap that. jump at that when it was pointing up. That was very smart. And... I'm still not smart. Okay. Can I just jump over here? I can dash over here. Oh, that's still down. Well, a little bit less time save. According to this, my PB has the best split of all on the mermaid split, so okay, interesting. Who's ready for the somewhat upcoming chat participation portion of the stream? You can either guess the code or type it in chat so we don't forget it. So glad I did not miss. Uh, there's four eyes. They can be up, down, left, or right. We have to figure out the answer to the code before I think we can enter there. As in, like, I'm not gonna just sit there and guess it, and I heard somebody say that they think it's just, like, required. Like, there's not actually a code that works until then. What does anybody get if they're right? I don't know. And then after we get the code, you can play the game of Remember and Spam it in chat in case I forget it. I don't think I've forgotten it yet, but just in case. Every single one of the doorways I went into corresponded to which direction you had to travel in the next room to get to the key. I just thought that was a neat, very small detail that I realized the other day during a run. Because this was the up-up room, and the key is up at the top of the room. The last one was left-left, and the key was far to the left of the room. Same is true for the other ones. Well, I've been running this game for a little bit, so... Please? 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 <laughs> okay, so like... I know what first made me realize it, right left for cash and code, is when you watch the world record run, when they come into this room, they do this to every single pot, and it didn't really occur to me, like, I had no idea, I just did it, followed along, was like, okay, I understand the instructions, this is like faster or whatever, I don't know, but no, this is because this dupes the payout of every single pot, jar. So later on the run, you just come back to this room. Okay, it was up, up, right, right. Very close. Probably. I don't remember what exactly everybody guessed. Uh, you both
both had the right idea that uh, it was going to start with the scene. Up, up, right, right. We need to... Don't do that one, that's just a prank. Left, right. Successfully, I don't have mermaid powers. I'm trying to switch to mermaid to get out of here. That's not how this works. I'm not a mermaid yet. Does I say an 11:59? 11:59. I'm about to save a ton of time. Good work. Now we turn to the mermaid powers. Sorry, spoilers. We're turning into a fish. By the way, dolls, if you also remember this dungeon. You may know that we're about to pass a funny block that we can't do anything about right now, so yes, we will be coming back to this dungeon later. Hi. Bye. Can't do anything about that yet. Bye. Funny backtracking. Right now we're just leaving all the way back to the eye that had two... the room that had two eyes in it. So this is not the room. This is not the room we want to be in. This is the room we want to be in. Never mind, next room is the room we want to be in. So apparently I want to hit that eye, enter here. That's not right. How do I get in there? Is this the cash room? This is the cash room. I don't believe you can do the chests, sorry. So this room would be broken and you'd probably have to do like no money farming ever if you could just dupe every single one of them. Uh, well we might be losing some time for a second while I try to figure out how to get into the room with the other half of the key. Does this have it? No. Survive. What is this room now? It's still money. Can we stop this prank? This is not going to be different, because why would this be different? It's different. Whatever, man. <laughs> uh, okay. Sure. Uh... I don't know, that just sounds like too easy. Would you bet on a dog named Cash? Would you bet on a lawyer named Lawyer? Fair. So I cannot spoil the rest of the run, I don't know how the next boss is gonna go, but the next boss is gonna go. Hi, VGM. Two status symptoms? Status? Status ailments? What are they called? Status conditions. Congratulations. I hope you've also avoided debuffs. Sure. This is a Pokemon. I mean, it doesn't have to be a Pokemon. Status effects. I was going for Pokemon. Call them like status conditions or something. Dolls can answer. 
Okay, we're gonna open the door here, not go in yet. We're a minute ahead of how we started this. I was trying to figure out what they're called in Pokemon. I thought they called them status conditions. It doesn't matter, they could just be debuffs. But you're not burned or paralyzed, so that's good. Enter the door. So this is another place where we will be attempting to do a funny. I've already told those who's in my pack, so I don't have to do that again. Switch to healing potions. That was too late. Need to heal before I die. for the GL VGM. A little bit late. A little bit early. I'm stupid. A little bit late. Uh, losing time. Hopefully we don't lose too much time. I got shot. for that one. Maybe? No. Too late, probably. I was sure that was going to be too early, but apparently that was it. So, definitely fine. I think yesterday we were, I mean, we're like four and a half minutes yesterday's run, so let's not pretend like anything but good news. Uh, now we get to go collect babies. said it, but I would like you to know that during one or several of my streams lately, I have said, slide, slide. I don't remember what I was doing, but I was sliding somewhere and I just said, slide, slide. It's definitely had a couple times. I also followed up with a jump, jump, don't worry. better than Mega Man. I can give it that much confidently. 
buy the rest of the fire and the zappy stuff from the shop. And cream. I have so much more money, though. Buy the rest of the fire and zappy stuff from the shop. I'm still rich. Oh, I don't have any... Whatever. It doesn't say to buy that, but I did it anyway. Uh, uh oh. I don't think there's anything that's like super dangerous, but I'm going to just pick up a couple more of these. Uh, okay, where are we going now? Elephant dash through a lilac fields to squid warp. Rest of the fire and zappy stuff from the shop. Back to the shop. Back to the elephant dash through the lilac fields. So this is another one of those ones where I think they just elephant dash here to not worry, have to worry about enemies. Or because it's several screens, so it's faster, I guess. Uh, we're going to warp to mermaid cliffs. For just a squid and then we immediately leave. Dash to the screen to the right. Uh, dance, dance. Transformation. Transformation! Wait, is that Triformation? Never mind. Party Ground! Sorry. Uh, keep going down. Transformation! I'm going to save time today by not entering this room and immediately transforming back into... Not... I almost was about to say squid. I am going to stay as a mermaid. Egg formation? That wasn't an event that happened, was it? Fijam, how much time do you think I lose in this game to loads? It feels pretty smooth to me. I also just don't know what load times are. Everything feels normal to me. It's a DSi game, it's fine. Sorry, DSi. This is DSiWare. I did just realize earlier though, I was like, damn, I could just be owning myself by playing PC games again. I was like, we literally just had this talk about how we don't play PC games, and now I'm playing another PC game. I don't need money, bye. Money, bye. Oh, thank God they didn't HDFI this game. Good to know I'm not playing the other game. I just swim around the top of the winter forest, navigate all the way back to the Squid Baron's lair. I hope you guys liked the Shantae stream art, because it's over. Sad face. <laughs> but can I run it? No, he just said they HDFI'd it. I'm doomed. Bro's dead. Okay, but can I speed run it? Did you think Mega Man 11 took that much? What did they originally release it for? Is it a 3DS game? I'm screwed. Do they have... Do they have the loading times? 
Do they have load removing splits? <laughs> it runs like this. For you? I don't know. I was on board until you said the HDFI'd it, and I was like, uh-oh. My next thought was, oh, thank god they didn't fix this game. Just the backgrounds. Listen, I have to turn the backgrounds off to play Terraria. Mermaid... Mermaid Cliffs? No, Seaside Retreat. Seaside. Do not go to the left. There's nothing to the left. I'm gonna go ahead and just eat the damage. Ouch. Worst part is, like, I don't even notice there's loads in Rabby Rabby, but everybody else watches it and they're like, oh dear god, I'm so sorry, and I'm like, what? Is there something wrong? Like, sometimes, sometimes the game just runs slower, but most of the other times I'm like, this game has loads. Seems fine to me. This one, like, does feel quicker, though, so that's cool. Um, okay. It was once common. Uh-oh. I think I've safely proven after the cut-in incident that that was just a one-time thing and my computer just does that regardless of where it is. <laughs> the problem is that I'm on Windows 10, dolls. I am no longer on Windows 7. Okay. Then you're good, bro. Seven is me now. For sure, bro. There's only one way to find out. I just have to buy Pirate's Curse. So then I can play it on stream. And go through this whole terrible arc where everyone goes, Are you okay? Why are you playing Shantae again? Time to make the Dogation goal of Pirate's Curse. I mean, Risky's Revenge. And then the next donation goal will be a computer that can run Risky's Revenge. Uh, I don't think- is this the right way? Then I go down. This is not the right way. I'm stupid. That's not the right way either. Guys, I'm doing it. I'm being brave. I'm gonna skip the money. Heart. 
sorry, maybe that was rude. Heart, 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 heart. Who's excited for the end of the run? Nobody? Damn. Elephant Dash all the way back to Hypno Baron's Lair. I know Negashante is excited for the end of the run, because she always wins. come back here to do the thing, in which case. Don't help. Rosalina sucks. Don't worry, VGM. I'll fix that for you later. Just be glad I didn't say Rydia sucks. She can suck all she wants. boss with six minutes of buffer last time. Today we're going to go in with more, so probably if we lose the same amount of time as we did yesterday, we will PB. I'm going to skip hitting the right one. Does this work? No. You really have to go all the way to the right and hit that one? How does this room work? Those are good. We need to have a talk. Okay. I'll bring a Shantae and some other ones so we can have a talk. Why am I trying to collect more money? I literally just debated about if I even want to finish the whole gem. code or left right for cash left right for code oh you want to see the other joke I remember or the other the other trick I learned the other day dolls I accidentally found a YouTube link in the written route that somebody made so I learned another small trick that we will be doing right here Slap this, jump in the water, jump up, grab it. Look, I'm sunken. I don't stay sunken, though. You float as soon as you start falling, so you just skip a transformation. Now, I don't know if I need more money. What am I doing? I don't know if I need more money. Well, I'm, I'm, I don't know. I'm probably going to need some money. To be 100% sure, 467 sounds like absolutely plenty, and I all okay, maybe not absolutely plenty, but I think I just like literally didn't even have to buy anything in the shop, so we'll be fine. I've got three jams. Am 
I about to save like even more time on this split? Am I bad at this game? Was I bad at this game? We're at the last jam. I think we're just done now. The only thing is going to be having Nagoshan to decide if this is a good run or not a good run. Pretty much. I may have finally lost count of how many times I've played the game. I could probably count it if you like really needed to know, but then I would start losing time trying to count. Uh-huh. Casual playthrough where I missed some items, I went back to get the rest. Three heart playthrough. Any percent run. When I've done like five hundred percent runs or something. Maybe six, I don't know. Is this going to be sub 2? <laughs> Set it up, I dare you. Sub-150 if you really felt like losing your channel points. No. I will not give you the magic seals, Risky. Fights RNG like doesn't matter, but we have to worry about 
if I'm gonna hit the frame on the next boss. It's the only thing that really matters. Barrel? That's an anchor. Walking, for sure. Are we just gonna continue this cycle? Are you gonna give me a barrel now? Sure are. Also, my split images are inaccurate. I made the split image for the last one, uh, Roddy Tops, because that was the image that displayed for like 100% number four hours. And then I found that the sub two hours overrides four hours. Yo. So the sub two hours one overrides the four hours, so. Assuming we finish in the next 20 or 30 minutes, we get the Shantae CG instead of Roddy Tops. So that's the most tragic part of these splits, is I was too lazy to fix that. Come back. Yeah. She like ran the other direction, and then I slapped, and she died. And uh, okay. Yeah, pretty much, pretty much, VGM. Sure did. Uh. Well, if the final boss went badly. I might have been like, hey, maybe this game will come back. But getting that first try feels like, you know, may maybe that's the end of the, this game. <laughs> I think the next position on the leaderboard was like 15 minutes ahead of me or something. So that might be the end of the Shantae arc, and the poll in the Discord may now be relevant. Not like I'm gonna sit here and try and pretend that this is the greatest run in the entire world, but I mean that craft just kept getting better and better. Uh, and then I just uh, first tried that, so it just feels like uh, might be a good time to just say, "Yep, I think we won." Was fun. probably had more content to it. Or more, more tricks. This was a fun time, though. I don't know if I'm going to sit here like this is a recommendation. For or against, but I don't know. If anybody likes the game, go ahead. If anybody likes the game or speedrunning, the problem is, is I'm talking to like one half of my chat who likes speedrunning and another half that likes uh, Chante. So I don't think I'm actually talking to anyone, but it was fun. Thanks for coming to the Chante arc. Uh, much like Ravi, I might play it again for the hell of it sometime. Less for like, I'm gonna get a PB and more to just because I can, but there you go. There's your there's your Shantae arc for now. Hope you enjoyed the Shantae arc. <laughs>